basketball is built into the fabric of Springfield College. The game was invented by Springfield College instructor and graduate student James Naismith in 1891 and has grown into the worldwide athletic phenomenon we know it to be today. In 1894 teams began to play with five on a side when the playing area was less than 1,800 square feet, 167.2 square meters. The number rose to seven when the gymnasium measured from 1,800 to 3,600 square feet, 334.5 square meters, and up to nine when the playing area exceeded that. The first recorded game between two college teams occurred on February 9, 1895, when Hamline University faced Minnesota A&M, which later became a part of the University of Minnesota. In 1895 the number was occasionally set at five by mutual consent. First match BWUS High School and College ba Basketball was introduced in France in 1893, in England in 1894, in Australia, China, and India soon thereafter, and in Japan in 1900. The first professional league was founded in 1898. Six teams took part in the National Basketball League, and the first champions were the Trenton Nationals, followed by the New York Wanderers the Bristol Pile Drivers and the Camden Electrics. The league was abandoned in 1904. Then, many small championships were organized, but most of them were not as important as some teams who played for money against challengers. It was the winter of 1891-1892. Inside a gymnasium at Springfield College, then known as the International YMCA Training School, Located in Springfield, Massachusetts, was a group of restless college students. The young men had to be there. They were required to participate in indoor activities to burn off the energy that had been building up since their football season. The instructor of this class was James Naismith, a 31-year-old graduate student. After graduating from Presbyterian College in Montreal with a theology degree, Naismith embraced his love of athletics and headed to Springfield to study physical education. Luther Halsey Gulick superintendent of physical education at the college and today, renowned as the father of physical education and recreation in the United States. The rules were printed in a college magazine, which was mailed to YMCAs around the country. Because of the college's well-represented international student body, the game of basketball was introduced to many foreign nations in a relatively short period.